That is more than my royal sensibilities can possibly bear. Leo? <laughs> We were just talking about how ultra lame Cleo and the Fear Squad are. Hey, those are my mates you're knocking. Well, maybe you should get better mates then, eh? <laughs> <laughs> you mean mates like you? Hey, girls. Claudine, how's things with you and Draculaura? She ain't talking to me. Neither is Claude. How's the sitch with Gil? Oh, better now. But it's so complicated, you know? I heard that. Cleo, how's Deuce? I swear, that boy drives me crazy sometimes. <laughs> I heard that! Frankie, please. You wouldn't understand. You're too young. It says in my Teen Screen magazine that mature girls like to talk about relationships. If you aren't in one, you may be left out. What do you mean? I, I totally understand. Really? Of course I have a boyfriend. You do? Where is he? Who is he? What's his name? We want to meet him. Um, well, you can't meet him now. Why not? He didn't come to school today, but he'll be better by tomorrow. You can meet him then. We look forward to meeting your boyfriend. Totally. Okay, well, um, I, I better go call and check on him. The only way I was gonna get a boyfriend by tomorrow was to make one. No prob. My dad did it all the time. How hard could it be? Well, I guess you'll have to do. Hey, man. That's awesome you and Laguna are cool again. I just feel terrible that I lied about my parents being okay with us hanging out. If she finds out, she's gonna be way upset. I know. Jealous much? <laughs> oh, you're so funny. <laughs> what? Dance right here? Oh, <laughs> so romantic. Aren't you going to introduce us? Sorry. <laughs> oh, this is, um, Kudud. <laughs> He's been just dying to meet you. <laughs> oh, what's that? <gasps> Two tickets to Justin Bider? <laughs> oh, you are the best, Kudud. Have you been reading those lame teen magazines again? Maybe. You don't have to have a boyfriend to fit in with us. I don't? No. You're fun and interesting and awesome all by yourself. That is a relief. I mean, I see all the drama you guys are dealing with, and I know that I am just not ready for boys yet. Even ones I made myself. You're breaking up with me after all we've been through? Why? Why? <laughs> No, no, no. This can't be happening. Go, you do something. I can't see. What's going on? The girls can get into the Gloom Beach Fear Leading Competition if they get a million hits on Fright Tube, and they're way close. But they gotta get it by 3 o'clock. Oh. I thought it was something I cared about. Why isn't it working? This is a tragedy. What's not working? What? Down in front, I can't see. Okay, hang on. It says here that the site shut down. What? So nobody can watch it now? Yeah. One minute to go. Go, 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 no, it's three o'clock. We didn't make it. Oh, I can't believe this. We were so close. Excuse me. Coming through. <sighs> what did I miss? Ghouls, I want you to know how royally proud of you I am. You're going to make me cry. <gasps> I'm serious. The way you came together as a squad to try to make this happen. Well... You guys have got more spirit than any ghouls I have ever met. And that's what Fear Squad is all about. I'm not crying. As if... Cleo, Cleo, check it! It's all over the Monster News Now site. Fright Tube crashed because of all the traffic to a single video. Your video! No way! I knew you could! Uh, whoa! What does this mean? Did we get in? Huh? I can't look. What's it say? Monster High Fear Squad, you are hereby invited to attend Gloom Beach Fear Camp! <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations!
congratulations to the Monster High Fearleading Squad who have just been invited to Gloom Beach Fear Camp. Way to go, girls! How many swimsuits should I bring? Is 40 pairs of shoes enough? Is there a suitcase limit? Congrats, girls. I'm so happy for you. Aw, you are so nice. We're totally pumped. Oh, I wish you could come with us. What are you talking about, love? I go to Gloom Beach every spring break. Me dad says they got the best underwater camping this side of the Barrier Reef. This is so awesome. Everybody together. We're gonna have the time of our lives. Okay, on three, everybody. One, two, three, Gloom Beach! Beach towels? Check. Shoes? Ten pairs of flats, nine boots, eight sandals. Is that all for today, yes? Fashionable and functional. Hey, now, look alive. The Gloom Beach bus has arrived! <laughs> Aren't you guys super pumped? Pumps! Oh, I knew I forgot something. I do hope you save some room in there for your fear-leading uniforms. You're wound too tight. Gloom Beach is about more than fear-leading. Yeah, the North Beach is too, it's amazing. There's a big lake, fun games, all of Too bad we'll be spending all of our time on the South Beach at the Fear-Leading Academy. All our time? Every year, the prestigious Gloom Beach Fear-Leading Academy awards the spirit staff to the best team. And every year, that team has gone on to win nationals. Coincidence? Hardly. We must have that stick. Apparently, Monster High used to win the spirit staff all the time. Back when we were... Good. G'day, girls. I'm stoked about spring break at Gloom Beach. Can't wait to hit the water. Back in your natural element, huh? No, I'm salt water, mate. Gill is fresh water. But you better believe I can still hold my own. How about a little song? Oh, oh. I'm just warming up. <laughs> better. <laughs> oh wait, if one cloud wolf is good, how about two, three, four, five? Oh, I just love Gloom Beach. Hey, it's my dream, right? Frankie, it's my ankle. You're going to have to lead the team. Uh, me? You can do it. We all believe in you, Captain. <laughs> he can't breathe. He needs water. <laughs> now that I've got this spirit staff, nothing can stop me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Cleo, oh, wake up! What? We're here! Oh. Ladies, welcome to Gloom Beach. It's even more beautiful than I imagined. Whew, refreshing! A ghoul could get used to this. Finally, we're all getting the recognition and respect that I truly deserve. Mr. Hack? Bring our bags around front. Your cabin is in a slightly different location. Wild cards. <laughs> Come on. It's not that bad. It is a dump. You said it, Ghoul. It's not exactly the four screamers. Why do we have to stay here when all the other teams are in luxury bungalows? Scary Murphy is a fear-leading legend. She must have her reasons. So you keep saying. <gasps> Scary Murphy. So, you're the wild card team. Not much to look at, are you, Buttercups? Oh, we were just on a... Quiet! No, this won't cut it. Your posture? Dreadful. Your attitude? Awful. Hustle up, lady. Move, move, move! <laughs> As the wild card team, got a lot to prove, Turtle Dove. What do we learn first? Advanced pyramid? Intricate dance routines? I've got something a little different in mind for you. I believe we have to prepare lunch for all the other teams. I'm sure Scary Murphy knows what she's doing. Now we gotta mow the lawn? This lady's getting on my last nerve. Scary Murphy's the ultimate fear-leading guru. If she says, cut the grass, you just say, hello. Yeah! <sighs> now this 
is more like it. Tell me about it. Nothing to do but sit and daydream. Sigh. I can't believe we wasted a whole day doing stupid chores for Scary Murphy. What did any of that stuff have to do with fear leading? I don't know, ghouls, but I believe in Scary Murphy. Yes! Yeah, score! <laughs> Not bad for a seawater gal. Thanks, mate. You're not bad yourself. You're a freshwater bloke. I told the other girls I believe Scary Murphy has a plan, but I'm not so sure. Torlai, what are you doing here? Bloom Beach is where all the cool cats and kittens come for spring break. South Beach is for fear-leading squads only. No quitters allowed. Oh, don't get your bandages in a wah. We just came by to tell you congrats for making it to Gloom Beach. Oh. Thanks. And that's why we're willing to come back. What? Now that your fear squad is hot again, we want to be back on the team. I see how bad you want that spirit staff, and we're your best chance to get it. You're right, Torlai. I do need you. <sighs> Told you. <laughs> to shine my spirit staff after I win it. What? <laughs> I wouldn't take you back if you were the last conniving kitty on Earth. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to get back to my team. You just made some powerful enemies. Better watch your back. <laughs> hey, Mom and Dad, it's me. I'm having an awesome time at Gloom Beach. I'm sure it's been a lot of hard work. If I dust anymore, my arm's gonna fall off. <laughs> Mine already did. Scary Murphy is playing us. None of the other teams are doing this stuff. Bats! Those girls are from Smug Snort's Vampire Academy. <laughs> they all think they're so hot. Why? Because they're, like, tall? Maybe because they've won nationals four years in a row. They're our biggest competition. Do they store a mean pot of soup, too? Chill, ladies. Gulia and I have been working on something ultra hot. It better be, because those smog snort snobs will do anything to win. Anything! But it wasn't all work. We were able to get in some much-needed R&R at the beach while Cleo and Gulia worked out our routine. <laughs> Gil! Wanna help me flog some drongos at Monster Polo? Uh, I can't. Come on now, Freshie. One game? It's such a good team. Uh, now's not a good time. Well, when? I don't know. I don't want to talk about it. Come on now, mate. You can tell me anything. Well, I can't tell you this, okay? I don't want to hurt your feelings. The beach was so much fun, but we had work to do. With Cleo's creativity and Gulia's eye for advanced physics, they came up with the perfect routine for us. That looks complex. <laughs> That's right, Gulia. It's been scientifically designed to win. All we have to do is learn it. Hey, pets. How's it going? What do you want? We just wanted to wish you luck before your big cheer. Anything else? Mm. Is that your routine? Yeah, it's amazing. This is an A-B practice, so see you later, traders. Let's get started. Oh, I'm gonna film it on my eye coffin so my parents can see. We start with a double jive hand wheel, then foot spring into a triple back layout. Everything was going great. Hi, it's Frankie, me. <laughs> daughter. Okay, I'm totally confident in our routine. As you just saw, we're gonna blow smog snorts out of the water. Oh, hang on a sec. Hey, Frankie. I just wanted to say that even though I'm not part of the team anymore, I really do want you to win. That's so nice of you. Oh, I was just finishing my video letter to my folks. I was gonna email it, but there's no Wi-Fi here. Oh. Well, you know, I can mail it for you. Just give me the thumb drive. Thanks. You're the best. Gotta run, Mom and Dad. See you soon. Wish us luck. <laughs> Wanna watch the Monster High routine again? Thought so. Oh, you're welcome, by the way. I'm so relaxed, I can hardly stay awake. <sighs> Don't get too calm. We've got the biggest cheer of our lives tonight. I want you ready. Chillax, fearless leader, with the routine you and Gulia came up with, we can't be beat. No thanks to Scary Murphy and her dumb chores. She has a plan. You just have to believe. 
Gil, you've been avoiding me all week. What's caught in your net? My parents don't want me hanging out with you. What do you mean? Because your people are from the sea. So? I'm from freshwater. It's forbidden. You don't believe that cod swallop, do you? No, but my parents do, and they won't allow me to be around you. I'm sorry, Laguna. Just picked up the mail. Can you put mine on the bed, please? I'm still getting ready. Me too. Me three. Frankie, Draculaura. Oh, why would Draculaura be getting a letter from my brother? Just friends, huh? First, smog slaughter cavalry. Let's go size up the competition. Yeah, let's see what a second place routine looks like. <laughs> Aren't those your moves? That's right. Your routine, scientifically designed to win in the hands of the enemy. I wonder how that happened. My video. <sighs> Told you to watch your back. Monster High wants the spirit staff. Yes, you do. But we stole your routine. Boo hoo hoo. <laughs> Good luck. You'll need it. It's over. After all my hard work. Our hard work. Now up, Monster High. What are we gonna do? We can improvise. We just have to remember our Gloom Beach training. All we learned was a bunch of useless chores. <gasps> oh, Scary Murphy is a genius. Just follow my lead. Yo, I hope you know what you're doing. Just believe. <sighs> I knew you had something special inside of you, sweet potato. That's why I was so hard on you. I wanted to bring out your best. Thank you, Ms. Murphy. Congratulations to Monster High, winners of this year's Spirit Staff. I can't believe it. Best day ever. Louder, ghouls, I can barely hear you singing my praises. Jealous? Why don't you take a picture? It'll last longer. Don't mind if I do. You got some real nerve showing your whiskers around us after what you did. Is that any way to talk to the new editor of the Monster High Fear Book? You're the new editor? And I thought you knew everything. Everybody reads the Fear Book. And you might say that I have a significant influence on how everyone sees you. Forever. So, how about a quick shot? Fine. Get this over with. A little to the left. Perfect. Smile. The captain should be up front. <laughs> Must have been a quick downpour. <laughs> Why didn't I know that Torlai is running the fear Did you book? get the text? Text? I'm the one who sends the texts. You're probably just out of the loop because fear leading took up so much time. Out of the loop? I am the loop. Frankie, have I become socially irrelevant? Oh, why am I even asking you? Everyone's wearing boas, Cleo. <sighs> this can't be happening. Hey, Dee. Uh, didn't see you there. My name is Draculaura. Dee is a letter, and apparently you hate letters. What are you talking about? I wrote to you every day at Gloom Beach, and you never wrote back. Hey, I totally wrote back. I don't even want to talk to you right now. I'm telling you the truth. I wrote you back. <sighs> I know they're in here somewhere. Aha! One of these has the power to see into the future, to keep me on top of all trends. <laughs> yes, Gulia, or unleash one of the several Egyptian plagues. But what are the odds of that? <laughs> Mighty Tonum, fierce and mean, make me queen of the social scene! Oh, what is the meaning of this? <sighs> I give up. Laguna, wait. Gil, I get it. You can't be seen with a saltwater gal. It's not me. It's my parents. It's just it. You won't even stand up for yourself, mate. Laguna. <sighs> what are you doing out here, little fella? That settles it. There's nothing I can do to regain my rightful place atop the school social pyramid. 
If anyone did that, then they would be the talk of the school for sure. Me, I'm doing it, me and my ghouls were all over it. Really? That's so brave of you, Cleo. Because no one's ever spent the night at Monster High on Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th? I just sent the text telling everyone you're doing it. I, I could send another one and tell them you're too afraid. We're not afraid of anything. That's the spirit. <laughs> Friday the 13th. I can't believe Cleo is making us spend the night here. <gasps> you want to spend the night here on Friday the 13th? <laughs> the school's charter states that I cannot stop you. You face a night of ghastly terror and unknowable horrors. No one's ever made it the whole night. Unknowable? Is that bad? Who knows? I'm not sticking around to find out! Nightmare Tally Ho! <laughs> Thanks again for staying with me, cool friends. Toral, I was just trying to make us all look bad. Mm -hmm. Friday the 13th is the anniversary of something horrible. They say that once the sun sets, a creature is awoken. He lurks about the halls of Monster High, prowling for victims. <laughs> Ew! Oh, that's ghastly. Ladies, it's clearly just a rumor. <laughs> we should split up, throw him off our trail. Meet you in the Quibateria. We gotta move! We split up, just like me and Claude! He never wrote me back! He doesn't care about me! He did write you back! I hid the letters, okay? Or better? No! You're supposed to be my best friend! Why would you do that? Can we talk about this when our lives aren't in danger? Oh, sure! Real convenient! <sighs> Look, I'm sorry! Shh! <sighs> at us. He's crying. <laughs> Careful. What's the matter, big guy? <laughs> Friday the 13th isn't the anniversary of something horrible. It's his birthday. Oh, he's just lonely. <laughs> but this hair, who's your stylist? <laughs> We've got to get you a makeover. <laughs> No way those scaredy cats made it the whole night. Hey, Torlai. Best night ever. Miss us. But how? No! <laughs> they told you everything was waiting for you. They told you everything was set in stone. But now you're feeling like a different ending. Sometimes you gotta find it on your own. It's an open book, a road in reverse, a brand new hook. Forget that.